Hi, Caitlin. Hi, Mauro. Welcome back. Oh, thank you. What do you think? I love it. Looks like Nathan did a beautiful job here. He did. I'm thrilled. Okay, sounds good. But let's make it perfect. Um, I did a great match from that little block there. And uh, we're ready to rock and roll, but we need to do some preparation first. Um, I have some drop cloths that we're going to protect the floor. I also get some exterior grade painter's tape that we're going to protect all the edges, protecting the floor with the post. All right? Sounds let's great. Let's get it done? Yeah, let's right, do it. Let's do it. Caitlin, let's pull this all the way down. All right. All the way down here, like that. That's fine. All right, Caitlin, it's time to do some sanding. I'm going to handle this 180 grit um, sanding block. What I wanted to do, I wanted to just smooth some rough areas nice and easy, break the edges a little bit, paint wood here better to it. Um, don't need to go crazy because we're going to apply a coat of oil based primer. All right. Okay. So I want to just use that, but I also want to put some gloves just in case if we see some splinters here and there. Okay. That will protect. Okay. All right. Let's get it done. And I will get my sander and I will do the post and the ratings and you do all this thing. Okay. We'll clean up the dust with the vacuum. All right, Kate, it's time to do some painting, uh, but we're going to start by priming. Uh, what I like to do for all my exterior work, when we deal with the bare wood, I like to use an oil-based primer. We'll get a better adhesion to the surface and we'll help the paint that comes on top of it. Okay. All right. And then for the paint, we're going to use a 100% acrylic is the color that I match from that little block. You match the color perfectly. It looks beautiful. Yeah. Okay. It's gonna be fantastic. It's gonna look exactly the same what you have at the rest of the house. Um, then I have those two guys here. Are we gonna use both of those? We're gonna use both. We're gonna use the mini roller for all the large surfaces. And then for uh, hard areas to reach, we're gonna use this two and a half angle brush. I see. Angle cut, okay? So we do this for all the flat surface and then it's just underneath or underneath the rails, we can do with the brush. I see. Okay. Ready to go? Yes, I am. Let's, Let's make this it. beautiful. Perfect. Let's do it. Don't forget to prime the bottom of the bottom rail because the bottom unprimed or unfinished is going to absorb all the moisture. It's not going to do any good for this paint job or for the wood itself. Great tip. Well, now that the prime is dry, we're going to fill all the nail holes with this exterior grade wood filler. Okay, we're ready for the first coat of paint. You ready? Let's do it, Mauro. Okay, it's been a while, it's dry, and it's ready for the second coat. Caitlin, you get the new set of railings done, and we just finished with this paint job. It looks nice. The color matches exactly the same. Uh, now it's going to be nice for you guys to go up and down, and more safely for the little one to go up and down the steps. They're beautiful, Mauro. I can't thank you and Nathan enough. They look like they've always been here. I love it. Thank you for having us here. Thanks for coming. Thanks for watching. This old house has got a video for just about every home improvement project, so be sure to check out the others. And if you like what you see, click on the subscribe button. Make sure that you get our newest videos right in your feed.